Geology on Mars, Lesson 2.3, Gathering Additional Evidence from Models. Activity 3, Observing a Flowing Lava Model. Here's what your student screen looks like for this part of the lesson. We've been focusing on Claim 1 for the past two lessons. Now we'll turn our attention to Claim 2, the Flowing Lava Claim. We'll watch a video of a new model to get evidence about whether flowing lava could have formed the channel on Mars. The flowing water model used real water to represent water in the natural world, but actual lava cannot be used to represent flowing lava. The flowing lava model uses wax to represent lava. They are both thick, melted substances, and we can use wax to learn about the landforms that flowing lava might form in the natural world. If the process shown in the flowing lava model forms landforms similar to the channel on Mars, this would provide evidence that the channel on Mars could have been formed by flowing lava. In a moment, you will carefully observe the model in a video. Then you'll record your observations and share your ideas with a partner. Notice where you will record your observations. Play the video. Pause the video at the end so that the image of the channel stays on the screen. With the pause video still projected, record your observations about the landforms that remain after the wax has stopped flowing and respond to the question about whether lava could have formed the channel on Mars. Share your ideas about whether flowing lava could have formed the channel on Mars. You can record new ideas as you share. Share your ideas with a digital partner if you have one. We use the flowing lava model to get evidence about the flowing lava claim. Does the flowing lava model support the flowing lava claim? Some of you might think that flowing lava model supports the flowing lava claim simply because the flowing wax did form a channel. Others might think that the channel formed by the wax does not look similar enough to the channel on Mars to support the flowing lava claim. At this point, both responses are acceptable. You have been gathering evidence about what formed the channel on Mars. By now, you probably have an idea of which claim you think is more convincing. In the next few lessons, you will consider new evidence from NASA about which geologic process formed the channel on Mars. End of activity. Be sure to complete all your student work in Amplify for this activity before moving on.